Join us at the Minnesota Beach Club Resort. Have an epic painting experience with me, Jacobina Trump, at the Minnesota Beach Club. to draw when I was a little kid and I, I didn't have the time at all all during my working life so when I got old I went to a retirement home where they had a lot of they had an art studio and an instructors and so I just sort of took it no, off and you call it meditation but it it, it uh, takes your mind off everything else yeah. it's like playing golf you know or you just uh, it's absorbing yeah Bob Buffum and his brother whose name I think is Charles Bob and Charles went to the same college I went to, Trinity College in Connecticut. And I knew them there vaguely, not, not closely, but I knew who they were. And I guess because of that, I must have gotten on the ma Minnesota mailing list somehow because these flyers would come across my desk, you know, uh, Minnesota Beach Club, and I knew, knew who the Buffums were, you know, and I knew, I knew about that. So one year, and we have family, my, my wife and I had family down here, and uh, friends, good friends, and we'd come down in Florida every winter for a couple weeks and make kind of a circuit around Florida. And one year we said, well, let's just try this Minnesota Beach Club for a few days, because it's right on the, on the route. And we, we really liked it a lot. I've been coming ever since. It is a talent. And I always thought, okay, when you have a talent, you develop it automatically. Because people will say, oh, this is great, you get a chance here. You get so you, you will, I went to art school, and I always thought, I cannot make a living of this. How am I going to do this? So I studied graphic design instead of painting and drawing. But when I came to the United States to live here, graphic design, I missed the whole computer uh, development. And you guys work in inches and we work in centimeters. That's a big difference when you <laughs> have a page in front of you. So I actually could not see how I was going to make now a living as a graphic designer. So then I thought, okay, then now I'm going to grab my chance to, to focus on being a painter. That took a long time. And in the meantime, I painted wall finishes. I was living in Miami. So decorative painting, murals. From murals, it became more and more canvas. And, and I did get a chance to develop that. Mrs. Buffum called me 
or I called her, I can't remember exactly, said, why don't you come over here? Because we have a lot of things to do that you are you can help us with. And when I came here, I actually took all the photographs. It was one of these days that was so bright and clear and warm in the sunset that I couldn't help but make all photographs. And then I thought, wow, this is great to, to make a book of this. Because by now my graphic design uh, talents or skills came back, back to the plate and I learned on the computer to work with self-publishing companies. And I always have been writing blogs and I thought, okay, let me write a story of the, the club. And then halfway, everybody was too busy to help me out with what the story really was. And I thought, okay, then I write halfway my own story. So that's, it's a, bit, it's a little bit strange book in that sense. But the, the photographs are just, I mean, the glow is just totally amazing. So I was very happy to, to do this. This is such a remarkable place. And it never changed. And when I came here in the summer, it was gray as could be. There was nothing, nothing. So I thought, I don't know. How am I going to, to do this? So in the summer, this, at this time, it was closed during the summer. So I stayed in the cottage, and I thought, I'm going to take on the challenge. But at six in the morning, it is very colorful here. It's gorgeous. At seven at night, same thing, beautiful. And then I realized I have to be very specific when I can paint and bring the color to the cottages. So that's how I started. But I, I taught myself how to paint here. I had a stack of magazines. And I thought, you know, nature is my teacher. I'm going to study it and study it and develop my own style in it. And you can see a little bit, the first paintings are now 20 years ago. That's a little bit different style than what I do now. 